How's it going, everyone? Maryland here, and that's right. It's time for some more Animal Crossing. In Cheville, mystery's been solved. We can all sleep peacefully, right? Well, I was just talking like I'm tired for some reason. I don't know why, but that's fine. It's all good. Okay, so let's see what is going on in Cheville. I didn't end up getting my my roses back just yet. They are in safekeeping though. I'm not concerned about them, but I, uh, you know, just so you know, they're they're all good. They're safe. All right, so let's see. Benedict and Goldie. Benedict? Benedict? That's weird. What? Oh, well, that's so bizarre. <laughs> uh, I've, I don't think I've ever had this happen before. Uh, he says, hey, Water, I was having a snack when I suddenly remember that time capsule I asked you to bury. Since I moved away, you can dig it up and have what's inside. Your old pal, Benedict. That's so weird. He moved out like a month ago. And from Goldie. Dearest Warner, how are you doing? I had something important to tell you, but I completely forgot what it was while deciding which stationery to use. Okay, that's funny. Uh, wow, that's really bizarre. This has not happened to me before. At least to my knowledge, I don't think it has. All right, what's going on, Rory? Uh, let's chat. Oh. Total time traveler. <laughs> hey! Get that shady business out of here. All right, let's see. Oh, Katrina's in town. Well, let's go ahead and... Yeah. Just closed. Just closed. That's a shame. Oh, well, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, so... I always bury the time capsule at the same spot, so let's go grab that really fast. Wait. What? Oh no, hopefully this thing on the ground didn't mess with everything. Now I, that's so weird because it isn't in the usual spot. <laughs> Usually I have it over right here. That's very strange. Oh yeah, all this money. I need to get this all sorted out. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to Isabel really fast. Hopefully that didn't jeopardize my, um, my whatchamacallit, my perfect town status. Should be fine. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Just a few more days until I get my golden watering can. Really need that. Really need that. Uh, oh, you know what? Orpheus, I have not yet gotten a scorpion. I was feeling kind of down. Last time I had an opportunity to, so maybe we'll go hunting for that tonight. Maybe just maybe. Um, alright. It's just so weird to open up a time capsule. I feel like I'm doing something wrong, but it is from Benedict. Man, that's just so bizarre. Okay. Hey, Benedict. Honestly, you could put anything in a time capsule and it would feel like treasure. Not that that's what I did with this time capsule. Yours truly passed me. Oh, that's actually really funny. <laughs> All right. So it's a tan dog tooth shirt. Wow. Okay. There was some anticlimactic finishing there. Gonna sell that thing, but that's definitely an odd way to start the the night. Someone put flowers up for sale? Like, who would do such a thing? Tutu, why? Oh, that's weird. Oh, I don't have anything being customized. I don't even have anything to customize. Okay, let's see. Let's get rid of some of this stuff I don't need. Well, 
I guess the shirt. <laughs> That's pretty much it. All right, I need to check out the area for a scorpion. Don't think that's going to be very easy. They are fierce. So I was doing a little bit of investigation for, like, what leaves in July, and I don't think anything actually leaves in July as far as, like, bugs and fish goes. I think it's August and September that stuff start to leave. So that's kind of good to know, I guess. Like, we're in summer, basically. Goldie! How's it going? Uh, buying a sandbag? <laughs> Fine, okay. I don't know why you brought a sandbag with you, but... You know what? To each their own? I just watch. Soleil's going to want this sandbag. She'll be like, this is the most fantastic thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Alright, how are you doing? Oh, you got a sudden craving for fruit. A simple piece of fruit. I won't get you just a simple piece of fruit, okay? I'm anything but that. We gotta get her a perfect orange. I feel like an orange would be a good thing for her. And an orange from out of town, I think, would be even better. All right, so... Sandbag, really? Why? Why a sandbag? I gotta do something with these gems. Uh, you know what? Let's just put that away for right now. Okay. Okay. Perfect orange. Oh, I don't even have it in here, do I? Maybe it's in B. No, but I do have my hat and my leaf. Can't be talking to people without my leaf now. There we go. And everything is right in the world again. I wish. All right, so let's drop this stuff off again. Perfect orange. Where are you? Get back here. Delicious. Okay, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. So how are you guys doing tonight? Are you having a good evening? If it's evening where you are, of course. And for that matter, even if it's not evening, are you having a good day or a good night or a good something? Hopefully you are. Mine's been all right, other than being a bit tired. Like, got some streaming done. Um, and not much else, really. Okay. Take this thing. Perfect orange. Orange, you glad. I brought this for you. I know, I had to make an orange pun. It had to be done. Uh, it's a moon. She gave me the moon. <laughs> what? That's so funny because Soleil in French means sun. Sun and moon confirmed. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. The moon. She gave me the moon. Why did she give me the moon? How did she even keep the moon in her pocket? She's like, just a tiny little thing. Uh, it's a big moon, if I recall correctly, right? The moon! Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. I kind of want to put it over by this big guy. All right, you know what? We're going to do that. It's going to be like, what? what's in the way? What's stopping this? What are you? Oh, darn you, dog. This is going to be like his energy bomb or something. Oh man, it'd be great if I could like put it behind him. So can I customize the moon? I know it's a dumb thing to ask, but I need to know. 
I do like this moon here. <laughs> it's really great. Like, it, it's just perfect with this guy. Uh, let's see. I guess I'll see if I can get it customized. I'll bring a backup just in case. I am curious. Because I do also need to update this sleek thing. Um, Gracie Bench. I do have to put this stinking bench somewhere. Let's put it where it belongs. There. <laughs> uh, oh man, Bacon Weasel saying you can turn it into cheese. I swear, if that actually happens. If that's actually a thing, that'd be amazing. Makes sense though. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. I like these bushes along the path. I think it oops, I think it looks really nice. I think that was a good idea. Alright! Cheese Moon! Give me please. Otherwise I have a backup option. Okay. I have a project for you. And, ah, no moon. <laughs> That's too bad. That would have been amazing. Okay, let's go ahead and refurbish this thing. Gotta make it a cow. All right, there we go. That'll look nice once it's all done. Like the whole set. I think I'm missing something though. I don't know what, but I feel like I'm missing one thing. For the life of me, I don't know what it is. All right, onward. Onward indeed. Oh, the owl has something to say. Is this a nine lamp? Sure, I'll go get it. Right. Oh, right. You know what? I should probably drop off some money really, really fast. Because I got all this, this decoy money in my pocket. Got about 500,000 I still have to pick up, but it's not a big deal. All right. I'm just glad we caught the criminal. Purple Rose Perpetrator. The case has been solved. The trial will be in the future at some point. Um, I'll keep you posted on that. It's not going to be too soon, so don't worry. Don't worry. All right, I want to get that moon. Oh, man, I see what the thing is. No, not this song. Uh, it sounds so good live, but I do want this director's chair. There we go. And I would like this. Looks fancy. And I'll take the nine lamp. I paid you, Bacon Weasel. I paid you the 10 million bells. Yeah, you can you can stop complaining about it. Totally did. All right, let's see. I think I have that already. Modern tile. I think I have that as well. Manor wall. I do have it in writing. I do, if you want me to bring proof. I will do so. This looks good. All right, let's see. Hydragena. Sign me up for that. 
Okay, let's get more of these. Great. How is my inventory space doing? I feel like I'm getting kind of full. Uh, let's see. I guess not that bad. Hey, I can't be responsible if you spent all the money on maple syrup and poutine. Like, just because you don't remember I gave you the 10 million bells doesn't mean it never happened, alright? You know, just saying. <laughs> alright, let's get this chick tea. Uh, is that it? I think that's it. Okay. And, man, so many repeats. What the heck? What the heck? Boring night here in Cheville. Boring night. Farme! Hello, Devin and Chad. Oh, man. If y'all hadn't seen the thing that I retweeted, it was actually really funny. Uh, it was... The fashion check the other day, and then getting bacon weasel over. Hold on, I need to I need to share this. It was, it's worth it. It's worth it. Wish Twitter made it a little easier to download images. All right, all right, get ready for it. <laughs> Wait, we gotta resize it. Uh, there we go. The case of the purple rose purple trader. <laughs> oh, that's great. I love it. I love it. That's from Farme. Let me go ahead and post a link. At least in the, the Twitch chat. Pretty funny. I like it. <laughs> alright, alright. Anyway... Let's get some music. I think I'm just gonna get... Actually, you know what? I want some suggestions. That's what I want. I don't know what kind of music I want. So... Oh, Cesar is here. That's interesting. What the heck? Wait. Oh, <laughs> never mind. We're fine. All right. So... What... What music should I play? I'm gonna look at the chat for a little bit while we decide. Um, I, I want some ideas. I want some ideas. Gotta chill with some music. Seeing Go KK Rider and KK Bossa. Hmm. Wish I could get a preview right now. <laughs> I don't want to like look it up or anything. Um. I do like OKK OK Writer. It's pretty good. Ooh, Salty Books with KK Disco. If I recall, I like that quite a bit. I could leave it up to chance, too. I'm not opposed to that. I kind of like that. Let's leave it up to chance. None of these are really striking my fancy here. Uh, yeah, give me some sound. Okay, you know what? I I just want you to pick something. We're, we're going to do that. There's some interesting suggestions, but we'll figure it out later. Besides, maybe it'll even be one of them. Hey, buddy. All right, it's AK Oasis. Ooh, that could be good. I beat the game! I did it! I won! 
I won. I like it. It's not quite, you know, rivers in the desert, but it's pretty good. I can see it fitting with water. Now I'm really curious how it'll sound, how the boot will sound. Speak to my curiosity. This sounds good though, I like it. Ow! <laughs> Orpheal is saying, wait, Marilyn's playing Ever Oasis? I can dig. I need to beat Ever Oasis. Like, I put it on hold so I could finish up Persona, and now it's done, so I think I should do that really fast. Apparently it's not very long. I was thinking it was, like, a lot longer, but I looked on how long to beat, and it was, like, I don't know, maybe 20, 25 hours. And I'm, like, I don't know, 16 hours in, so... I've enjoyed it a lot so far. I could see streaming it. I'm not saying I'm going to, I'm just saying I could see it. <laughs> All right, there we go. Cool, man, cool. Check out your pockets, I slipped you a boot. Oh yeah, I got the boot. All right, I better scoot now that I got the boot. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, how is this going to sound? That's what I need to know. Oh, I should go check to see if I have blue roses, or more blue roses. I mean, obviously have blue roses, but only one. All right, let's drop it off. Hey, what are you two up to? All right, how does this sound? I can almost see it working. We'll have to see. I don't remember how it sounds. This is okay. Except my gyroids are just dead. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. I think we'll save that for somewhere else, but I don't dislike it. I think it's pretty cool. Um, all right, what else? I got so much junk over here. Yeah, we'll go over here. I want to see if I got the blue roses. I also want to see if I can find that darn scorpion. That is going to be a pain. A very big pain. Speaking of very big pain, I hear a present. Where's it coming from? Should be arriving, if I'm not mistaken. What's down here? Where the heck is that thing? There it is. All right, we're we gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Got it good. All right, what did you drop? A washer dryer. What was that doing in there? That's so weird. And oh, no, you're a pink rose. I don't need you. I don't need you. Oh, well, we'll set it over by the other pink roses. 
So someone must have put in too much of the the detergent. <laughs> so it's just all bubbles in there. That's clearly what it was. You ever seen that on like cartoons where they do that? Yeah, it's pretty funny. Okay. Can I find... Oh, you know what? Sometime we're going to need to do a stakeout for the giant stag. Oh, my baby! <laughs> uh... Okay. I gotta put something cool in her house. How about a washer dryer? I could give her a moon. I could give her a nine lamp. I'm gonna give her a nine lamp. I think I'll do that. I wanna hold on to my moon. Oh, I could order another moon. Like, I could just give everyone moons. Like, she wouldn't really have room for a moon. But that would be pretty funny. Um. Hmm. I'm gonna give her the nine lamp, because I'm gonna sell it otherwise. Actually, I am going to give her the moon. Because why not? Here, take my moon. <laughs> We're just passing the moon around. Oh, a moon? Good call. Right? I gotta take a picture of that. Where are you going to put the moon? That's what I want to know. A ranch tea table for the moon. Hmm. I feel like I got a less than desirable deal here. Bones! You want a ranch tea table? Oh, you want to get rid of a playroom wall. Fine. Fine, that's all right. Okay. <laughs> I gotta sell some stuff. My inventory is just clogged. So badly, we need to take, like, a plunger to it. So let's go ahead and dump some of this off. For here. Hey, Reese. It, well, actually, I want to hold on to the plant. Um. Yeah, there we go. That looks good. Okay, so we're all set. Nothing else to buy in Main Street. I don't have the moon anymore. I'll order it again. Like, I don't even know for sure if I want it. Like, it's kind of novelty. It looked neat, but I think it's dangerous for one person to own the moon. I think we should share the moon. All right, can I get some gems? Nope. Just money. <laughs> I don't need more money. I need gems. In fact, realistically, I don't even need more gems. I need more gold. That's what I need. Okay. So, let's see. Where am I going to put these bushes? Actually, I'm going to put them right over here. Gold, do you have fleas? You have fleas! Bad dog. Get fleas. Get, whoop, I missed. Don't get fleas! All right, there we go. Let's get rid of this thing. Go away! <laughs> go away! Uh, okay, so if I recall, I can put two more bushes right here, and I don't think either of them will die. I think if I place one more, though, I'm pretty sure it will die. Because you can have up to 12 in a row, I think. I think! I'm not 100% sure, but it seems like that number sounds familiar. Okay, so maybe, just maybe, I should be hunting for the scorpion. That's gonna be tough. <laughs> uh, let's see, does anyone have any good tips? I ran into one, but it kind of despawned while I was trying to get set up, because I wasn't really ready for it. 
I feel like if I have as much of an angle, um, like upward like this, I think I should be able to spot it more often. Okay, let's get this gyroid. Don't hold your net while you look for them. That actually does sound familiar. I just have to make sure that I can switch to it fast enough. Because that was a problem I ran into last time, if I recall properly. Uh, let's see. They'll automatically jump at you if you have it out, but if you bring it out while near them, they won't attack you. Okay, that's really good to know. I know that they despawn right away. I'll have to watch out for that. Let's see. Actually, realistically, if I see a scorpion, I should probably just Go into my inventory or something. Hmm. Okay, let's set up its net. Okay, there we go. That'll do. Um, let's see. Soleil, have you seen anything potentially lethal around here? Goldie, have you? Just a quiet evening. So then a scorpion won't attack me. I don't have the net out. Is that... Am I understanding this correctly? It's been a while. I think I caught one way back in my Waffles game. Maybe on Benchton. But it has been a long while. Like a dingloid. Uh, let's see. Bones. I just heard a present. Where was it? We might not be able to find that thing tonight. But it doesn't hurt to look. Let's leave it at that. Gotta do something else, right? Oh, okay, I guess it wasn't a present. It was bones shaking the tree. Not getting anything. What a genius. Okay, I gotta go back to the south side, I think. Uh, let's see. Max LP Queen asking, when is Agnes moving? I think the 4th, if I'm not mistaken. It's not like immediately. Uh, let's see. And I'm kind of torn. Like, we really need to get rid of one of those personality types. We have three of the Uchi personality type. And that... That's a little excessive. I think we can mix it up a little bit more. Actually, for that matter, what would be a good personality type to bring in? I feel like we have all of them. What am I missing? Uh, we have normal. We have Gucci. We have oh, uh, whatever Soleil is. We have Jock. We have Smug, we have Cranky, we have Lazy. Which is the other that I'm forgetting about? <laughs> Gosh darn it, I don't remember now. Snooty, that's what Soleil is. Which seems rude, because she's so nice. Peppy. That's right, Tutu's Peppy. So we actually have every personality type represented. Alright, I guess it's not as bad as I thought. 
What? Yeah, I'm with you on this one, Rory. We do need a police station. We gotta keep this town clean. Man, I could have used this like a week ago. <laughs> All right, Rory, you uh, you get some huge points for that, buddy. We're building a police station now. Oh man, that is long overdue. Long overdue. Okay, police station. Man, I really wanted that suggested. All right, we gotta build this thing. You know, I also need to upgrade the town hall at some point. Oh, shoot, I don't remember. Which police station did we have in, in uh, Benchton? I actually don't remember. Uh, shoot. That makes a huge difference. I don't want to check. I've been kind of keeping the game on ice for a while, but I don't want it to be the same one. Darn it. Okay, well, I have to look it up. My dream address from that town doesn't work. Because, again, it hasn't been updated. Uh, let's see. We're going to Benchton. I gotta look this up. Because whatever one is in Benchton, I want it to be separate from the one in Cheville. Uh, when did I get that? Hmm. Man, I missed that series. It was a lot of fun, too. It was entertaining. It had, what was it? How many days did it have? I feel like it had a lot. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Like I thought I had it as a title because I usually title things. Um, I guess I could just look at the end. Possibility. Did I end at day 170? It did. Hmm. All right, let's see. Oh, you hear that beep? <laughs> uh, all right, so I don't have either police or station here. It's a shame. Okay, well, it's day 180. We did have 180 days. All right, I ended it on my birthday. Oh, man, it's so crazy looking back at this series. I miss this town. I can't wait to revisit it. Okay. I had Lily? I completely forgot I had Lily. I kid you not. Uh, where the heck is the police station? Just find that in my game. Are you good? Wait, is that it? By the coffee shop. I just need to know, okay? I need to know. Once we figure it out, we'll be good. Um, oh, of course, I'm not going that way. Okay, it was the the wooden one. It was the classic police station, not the modern one. So we're going to build the modern one this time. Confirmed. Okay, modern police station, which actually fits a lot better because I want this to be more of a modern town. All right, thank you for your patience, by the way. I'll just watch the the scorpion be out while <laughs> I'm guiding Isabel. So where do I want this thing? Where are you running to, Bones? Where do we want the police station? Where I'm thinking would be good. 
I think right over here might be nice. I think. Alternatively, we could have it maybe over there. I don't actually remember how big this thing is. I think it's smaller than the um, coffee shop. All right, does it fit here? Too close. What? What? Oh man, that's gonna be big. But does it fit here? No! All right, well, there goes that idea. We're not having it here. So we're not going to be able to place it along this row either. We could maybe put it... It could fit right here, perhaps. It's gonna be cutting it close, but let's just see if it's an option. I don't really know if I like it or not. Ah, uh, too close to a giant rock. Why can't we just get rid of that giant rock? Okay, can we like place it here? Still on about that giant rock. Come on. All right, well, we're not going to be able to place it over here. I kind of wanted it to be, you know, close by to everything, but it appears that's just not going to be an option. Um, so we need to find another place. Yeah, the top left corner of town. I kind of wanted to put this there, but there was a reason why we didn't, and it has to do with paths. Because apparently we couldn't put a path right by the thing. So, like, it just looked a little awkward. I'll try it again. Like, let's just take a look. Like, I don't think it'll fit back here. Yeah, it's not going to fit back here. But maybe over here. I think there is a chance. I think it might have fit. But one of them fit. Uh, okay, so the problem with this is I don't think I can place anything right where the the thing is. I don't think so. Maybe. Let's take a look at my other game. Because perhaps that was just an issue with... Um, yeah, it doesn't look like you can. So basically there'd be this area without a path going over here. Be a shame. Um, I don't think there'd be room right here. So, that kind of doesn't really give us a lot of places to put this thing. I think we're going to have to put it down by Bones' house, perhaps. Hmm. Could put it where Leonardo's was, have it kind of down here. That actually wouldn't be that bad because this is kind of symbolic of where some of the money was taken for the Purple Rose perpetrator. I think that would help make Soleil and Goldie feel safer. Oh man, if only it would fit right here. I don't think it will, but actually this wouldn't be a bad spot. All right, this is going to backfire. I don't think it's going to work here. Okay, what do you think? Yeah, too close to the river. So if I were right here, does that still keep it too close to the river? I don't even know if this is where I would want it. Yeah, that's still too close. Okay. Because I might eventually want to build, like, a bridge down here. Like, move this one and replace it with a different one. Actually, this is a good location, too. It's close enough to the coffee shop. There's nothing really going on over here. Like, we could put it right here. That's a good spot. Either there, or... We'll put it, like, I guess theoretically we could put it right here, but I think it'd be cooler if we had something else there. Alright, is this an option? That's what I want to know. This is, like, option number two. 
Well, really, option number one. Let's be real. Okay. Too close to the river. So, see, this just isn't going to work. Yeah, that's just a no-go. So, I think what we'll do... I think we'll move the police station... We'll build the police station right over here. I think this will be a nice kind of central location for it. There's enough stuff kind of around here to keep it interesting. Um, that'll be good. All right, let's set it up. I had it, like, centered right here. Okay, so we're going to do this method of centering. Three. All right, four. So then over here, we'll have... Wait, no, I don't want to talk to you. Don't want to talk to you. All right. Yep, yep. Just get out of the way so I can dig this hole. All right, so one... Two. No, darn it. Okay, so it is going to be off-center, but that's actually fine, because right now the paths are too wide. Well, not off-center, but it's not an odd number. Actually, that is a problem, because the police center is a 3x3. Three three. Hmm, so that was some weird moves you had there. Alright, one, two, three... One, two, three. So then, right around here would be the center. It would be these two right here. So it won't be centered, but that's okay. It's not a huge deal. Oh my gosh, are you serious? And you just are not cooperating with me tonight, Isabel. Okay, so what about over here then? Otherwise, it's not going to be centered. It's just going to be placed on the corner. Okay. How does this look? I think that'll work. I think it's fine. It's a decent spot for it. I think we can build some stuff around it. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Wait, why? Oh, no, it's set one back. <laughs> Darn it! How did that work out? I could have... Eh, whatever. You know what? It'll work. It's fine. It's fine. We'll build around it. That's what it boils down to. Oh, man. Uh... Okay, so Fang Lightwind saying I could put the police station by Sylvia's house. That's actually my first suggestion, or first uh, inclination. And I tried it, and there wasn't enough room with the path, like, with the river. So that was rather unfortunate. Okay, how much does it take to get this thing built? I think it's like 200 some odd thousand. Uh, 264000 Alright, let's go get that money. Gee, if only I didn't deposit it right beforehand, huh? Hey, Esterlin with 100 bits saying, Hey, Marilyn, I accidentally watched a bunch of your videos with my ad blocker on, so I watched a bunch of ads to send you these bits and say sorry. Thanks for all the awesome content. My goodness, that's really nice. Thank you so much for that. That's... <laughs> That's a really funny story, actually. I really do appreciate it, but, like, it's atoning <laughs> for your sins or something. I honestly don't mind if people use an ad blocker or whatever. You know what? I get it. No one likes ads, but it's really nice that you realize, hey, you know what? They do help content creators, and it's great that you saved up some bits so you could, uh make up for it <laughs> really appreciate it probably ended up being more than I would have gotten in ads anyway well maybe I don't know the way thank you that just that cracked me up <laughs> it really did oh man but I'm glad you enjoy my content
I really do appreciate that. All right, so let's grab some money. Hey, Pokemaster986 with 100 bits as well saying, did someone say add bits? Here's all mine. Awesome. Thank you so much for the bits. Really appreciate it. Okay, so Zap saying I keep ad blocker on people that I support on Patreon or I'm a Twitch sub to. All right, let's see. You know how I always call you Worder? A new nickname to keep things fresh. Oh, please do. Uh, how about W guy? You're looking at my hat. Sure, fine. It's a weird nickname. <laughs> w guy. What's up, W guy? <laughs> Goldie, you need a little bit of work with your names. Here I thought you were going to get me, like, I don't know, some kind of cute little name or something. W guy. What? What? Okay. What? Is oh, yeah, I want to pay off the police station. And I want to find that scorpion. They are rather uncommon, so I might not be able to find one tonight. Like, we'll look a little bit more. All right, I'll cooperate. Yeah, there we go. Yeah! All right, let's see. So... Uh, I'm glad you are amused, Pokemaster986, that Muxy didn't show the emote and said it just said, seems goo. Seems goo. Yeah, here. Alright, I need to go find that darn scorpion. Must reveal this thing. Must catch it. Sorry for the yawns. Like I said, I'm tired today. I don't know why. Just am. I'm gonna be even more tired tomorrow morning, though. Oh, mornings, my mortal enemy. So, it has now been 62 days, I think. Yeah, 62 days of streaming Animal Crossing every single day. Well, that's not changing tomorrow, but it is changing soon. I don't know how just yet, but I will be taking a look at the schedule just to kind of see, okay, what can I do to, you know, just mix things up, I guess. I was thinking about it, and I've been talking about this for a few days now, but I would like to have one day a week that I don't stream, or at least one day. Maybe it'll be two. And I stream more on certain days. Um, but I think that would help keep things from, you know, being like a burnout, you know? That's not any good. Uh, you know, no one should feel burnt out. And thankfully, I don't. I don't feel like that burnout right now, which is great. I mean, I would definitely be a lot more cranky if I were starting to feel it. Like, yeah, you can tell. But I don't want that to happen. Like, I am an introvert. That means I need time and I need space just to decompress. It's kind of how us introverts work. And although streaming isn't, like, that tough, remember, it is still talking and interacting a lot. And not just, like, well, I mean, it's playing games, but it's playing games while chatting and reading a chat and trying to be entertaining and being on camera and all of that. And... It can take a bit of energy, especially if you're more of an introvert than an extrovert. Now, does that mean I'm stopping streaming? No, don't worry, don't worry, but uh, I don't want it to come to a point where I feel like, oh, this stinks, I never get time, I never do this and that, and I did try to have, like, semi-days off, like, 
It used to be Monday and Thursday were kind of my days off because I only had one Animal Crossing stream in those days. And that was it. You know, I did that, and then end of the day, we're all good. Everything's set. But then Thursday, I threw in the, the vodcast. So that's another three hours that I don't really have to, like, talk or anything. But still, another three hours that I kind of invest with you and share my time with. Uh, especially because, you know, it's not like I just leave it on and you guys watch it. I interact. I watch the whole thing with you guys. So that's a thing. Um, yeah, hi. Have you seen a scorpion? Take my patchwork table. Uh, sure. Why not? <laughs> that doesn't seem suspicious at all. Uh, okay, that's just a little weird. Yeah, so I need to start looking at what I want to do. Um, I don't know exactly what the plan will be. Because, again, I haven't looked at it just yet. But I know probably, like, one of the days. I know I want to do weekends. Like, I got no problem taking a break on a day other than a weekend. Let's face it, a lot of us tend to be a little bit more free on the weekends. I mean, some of you have plans. That's the thing with schedules, okay? I'm never going to be able to find a time that works for everyone. Time zones and schedules just don't allow for that. It, it just doesn't. So I just have to try to figure out, you know, what works and what doesn't. And I think I'll be looking at, like, stats and stuff just to kind of see. Look, maybe this week and last week, like, which time slots and which days weren't people tuning in as much because then those are probably the days I can get away with taking off a little bit more. Um, hmm. I mean, that's just what I would think would be the best. I don't know. Again, maybe it depends on what I'm streaming too. Another thing I have to stop myself with is there's like all this stuff I want to stream, but I don't have time. It's like, no. I want to fit in Terraria streams. I have been watching quite a bit of Terraria on Twitch lately. I've been watching a few people, and it's been entertaining. Like, I think I could do that. I think if I did my expert mode thing, did some builds, maybe made it like a montage for YouTube, because people really like the, uh, the builds. I just need to find, like, a good checklist or something for getting all the items, because that's one thing I, I do still want to do. It just got a little boring, but, you know, maybe you guys would like it on Twitch. Or maybe not. I don't know. It might be a disaster, but then we can just phase it out and do something else for area. But I think that's something that people on Twitch want to watch, and there's just not as many people streaming it as you think. Like, that's what I've noticed. Like, there's a few people, but not as many as you'd think. So that could be kind of fun. But again, finding like time for that. That's a tough thing. And then, um, oh, what was the other thing? Uh, happy home designer. I think it'd be neat if we did like one house or one build a day. Well, every day that we stream in Happy Home Designer. I don't know really how or when or why or whatnot, and maybe you guys don't want to see that, but it could be a kind of nice touch or something to do on the side. Could be something amusing. Again, I don't know if that's a direction I want to go, if it's more or less entertaining than good old Animal Crossing, but we're starting to run out of things to do on a daily basis. Or Animal Crossing. Like, I mean, there's still stuff to do. Like, it's not like, oh, I'm bored. I'm gonna quit. Uh, no. <laughs> That's not happening. But it's also one of those, like, do I really need to sign on just to check the shops and talk to the villagers every day and stream it? Like, you know, if we have a big project or something, that'd be good. I also think it'd be nice if we had one week, like, per month, that we did like a big subscriber blitz or something. So visited a bunch of subscriber towns like every day in a week. Um, let's see. 
Okay, three questions. What kind of weather do you like? Uh, I like windy weather, thank you. How would you describe Cesar? You saw this in a magazine? Uh, he's... he's funny. Which drink sounds best to you right now? Oh, man. Actually, I could go for some green tea right about now. Uh, dedicate yourself to the art of reading novels. That's like your solution to everything, Goldie. Okay. But yeah, um, that's something that I think would be rather interesting, just to give thought to, like, visiting other towns. Because I know a lot of you would like that. And I wish I had time to visit everyone's town. Well, for subscribers' towns. My 3DS is full. I need to figure that out for tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> it's got 94 right now, and I have, I think, 10 or 11 to add. So, I'll figure it out. It's not an issue, but again, that's definitely part of the reason why. It's like, I need to go through some of these, you know? Do some visits, do some stuff. As long as I can keep it to... Like a 20 minute tour, let's say 20 to 25 minutes. That's the problem I tend to have. I tend to have a hard time keeping it to a schedule. So maybe even if we put like a timer on the screen or something, uh, not to rush people, but just so we'd be able to get three done per day, every day. So maybe we'll shoot for this sometime in August. We'll have to see. But for right now, We'll do that on Sundays. And that way it'll cover all the different time slots. Oh, Pokemaster986 saying there is a timer in ACNL after all. Hmm. That actually sounds like a good idea. I should go take a look at that. Well, not having any luck finding that scorpion so far. That is what I'm on uh, the prowl for right at the moment. I've seen one so far in town. And that is it. And it just kind of slipped away into the night. Couldn't even get it. So I guess right now it's just a matter of scaring away any bugs on trees. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go over here. Let's see what's at campgrounds right now. Oh, what? Outdoor sign. I gotta get that. Oh, was the scorpion not available until 9? I thought it was 8. Wood display stand. Wood, and you know, I'd like to get that. Alright, I guess I'll buy it. Okay, well that explains why I couldn't find one a little bit ago. I could have sworn it was 8. Maybe it was 7. I don't know. Well... Either way, I know it's uncommon, or rare, rather. They're not easy to find. I wonder if it's something that you have more odds of finding if you have bad luck. I don't know. Because I could go mess with my feng shui really fast. I don't know if that would actually make a difference or not, but... Uh, let's see. Neon Evie saying, according to AC Wiki, it's 7 p.m. to 4 a.m. All right. Gosh, there's a tarantula. Mmm, got ya! Not the rare thing I needed, but I got it nonetheless. I guess I'll take that as a personal victory. Okay, um... Well, I guess I'll hold on to that for much later. Just for that day someone's like, Yo, you got a tarantula. I'm like, as a matter of fact, I do. But you see, that one I could actually hear shuffling around. Hmm. 
Now I just gotta find that scorpion. <laughs> Gosh darn it. I will get you, scorpion. I will. Okay, but we're gonna put this little guy away for safekeeping. Um... I have a rainbow stag! Um... Did I... Did I always have that? Did I? I actually kind of worry. Maybe I... Do. Hmm... Interesting. Uh, I'm gonna put this stuff away for right now. Oh, you know what? My table should be ready, too. Alright. Let's see if I can find the scorpion. Get out of here, bug. That'd be nice. Tarantula and scorpion in one night would be really choice. So again, if I could be down here, it's a little easier to see it kind of like moving along on the horizon there. Soleil, I thought you were a scorpion for a moment. I never thought I'd actually say that, but it's true. Let's see something over there. I also need to get a snail at some point. I think I do, because I think the time I got it in someone else's town, there was a disconnect. Uh, let's see. I'm glad I could hear that tarantula. That's really what gave it away. Hmm. Yeah, just a bunch of... Looking around. Thought I heard something. I don't see it, so probably just my imagination. Uh, let's see. Wait, bug. I guess I should go get that table right now. Since I'm out and about. Ah! Wrong place. <laughs> I need to go over here. Okay, bones! I need to be on the lookout for a dangerous animal. Well, a dangerous insect, rather. A dangerous something. That much I know. All right, cow table. Cow table. Well, sideboard, but you get the idea. Okay, next up, scorpion. On the hunt. Man, I'd laugh so hard at Bones is just like staring down a scorpion. That'd be really funny. You probably wouldn't be able to fight it. Okay, so I was doing a little bit of thinking for Cheville Idol too. Don't think I've forgotten about that. I actually went ahead and I sorted out all the cards um, by the die number. Now I want to have them sorted into different groups. So we're going to redo the die grouping. But I don't think we're going to have it done the same way. I actually really like the whole island adventure thing, the desert island escape. Did you guys like that? Did you think it was fun? Because I enjoyed it a lot. Oh, hey, what's up? We weren't here a moment ago. Uh, let's see. What did I do? Oh, yeah. Refurbishing. Okay, I didn't even know there was a badge for that. <laughs> I didn't really refurbish a lot of stuff back in the day. Well, maybe I did, but... 
All right, there we go. Refurbishing beginner. Nice. So I was thinking of doing it this way. We'll have a vote for Twitch subscribers. So it'll kind of be... The heck was that sound? Uh, it'll kind of be like it was last time, where there will be six different villagers you can vote for. They will be separated into six groups based on their die number that shows on the card. Now, we're going to be doing away with the rock, paper, scissors thing. I think that that seems like it, I don't know, made it a little confusing, a little less, like, interesting maybe but i think what we'll do we'll take the top three from each of the die groups and maybe have them like fight it out against each other so a one on one so it'd be the top three and then the group that survives or wins or i mean if they both lose well huh but the group with the highest score of the two that are fighting, they move on to the next round. And then... It kind of continues that way, so... Like, sort of an elimination tournament type thing. And then eventually, like, some of the members will be shuffled around into other groups, and we'll just kind of keep it up that way. I don't know. I don't know. You'll have to let me know how much you like the Desert Island Escape way of doing things, or if it should be done some other way. Because in the past, we had it so we voted for, like, six villagers, and then, um, where'd it go? Six villagers, top two highest votes, they would fight in a rock, paper, scissors match based on what their card was. And then the six winners from each of the groups would be determined essentially at random. It was going to be through a die roll, but realistically it was easiest just shuffling them. And it was all right, but I feel like we can do even better. So I think if we did something involving Desert Island Escape, with the top three from each of the groups, and then have something that shuffles them around afterwards. I don't know. Could be cool. Or it could be really boring. All right, Scorpion. I think this guy's scaring away all the good bugs. So ideally, I want to see that thing on the horizon over there, because that makes it, like, the easiest to find. Because otherwise, trying to even track down that thing in the first place is a pain with all the trees everywhere and being kind of dark and it kind of blends in. I still have my net. Yeah, there we go. All right, so... Keep this up for a little bit more. I'm not going to be doing this all night, but this is a bug that I need to find. I only wish I would have found the scorpion instead of that tarantula. Like, I'm glad I got the tarantula and it didn't get me, because that thing can get you. Either of these two can totally get you. Knock you out. It's embarrassing. <laughs> I did it once on purpose. And it was really funny. Oh, gosh. Boom! Another tarantula! <laughs> this is not the one I need! I need a scorpion! Alright, well, I guess we'll keep it up. I got some room in my inventory still. Oh, where the heck can I find this thing? <laughs> oh, man. Like, everyone says I'm so lucky. But it's not the one I want! 
Wait, what happened? Oh, they're talking! Hey, what's up? Oh, just calm down. You're making a fool of yourself in front of Warder. Wait, she is? No, we're going to settle this. You know, diddly squat about rock and hair. <laughs> uh, let's see. All I said is that I don't get why everyone thinks mohawks and pompadours are stylish. Oh, Warder, what did I say that's so wrong? I mean, I'd rather have a pail of shrimp tempura dumped in my head than rock those looks. What? You did not just say that. Hey, buddy, you settle this. Which do you think is cooler? Pompadour, mohawk, or neither rocks? Uh, I mean, realistically, the pompadour. Yeah, because the pompadour is, is, it's like your brain's rocking out so hard that your hair explodes. Well, I still think I'd prefer the pale of shrimp tempura. Okay, well, we averted a crisis here. Alright, thank goodness for that. Okay, scorpion. Scorpion. At least I'll have two uh, tarantulas for those special missions. When someone, like, desperately needs one. Well, that, I mean, in town. You can't trade bugs with, like, other people. Hmm. I'm just glad that I managed to actually catch them both. I always get so nervous. Uh, let's see. Which direction is that present going? Oh, I gotta hurry. Oh! Yeah, there we go. Almost dropped it. We got a balloon dog lamp. Not this thing again. Alright, do we still have the net on the ready? Yes, we do. Okay, no more tarantulas tonight. Only scorpions. Only scorpions. In fact, only one if I just need the one. Like, if I can catch it, that's all I need. I only need one scorpion. I don't need to show off. Just want one. And I don't want anyone to be like, yo, <laughs> I see you have a scorpion there. You gotta give that to me or I'll hate you forever. Like, on the way to donate it. Like, that would be the worst. It'd be so bad. Hmm. Scorpion's a fish, right? Probably be scaring away these fish. I'm just kidding. All right. Anyway, <laughs> let's see. Can we find a lovely little scorpion that doesn't want to kill me? That won't ever give me up. That won't ever run around and desert me. How are you? 14 hours of sleep per night? Dang! I actually don't think I envy you. I think that's just a little too much there. Like, okay, don't get me wrong. There are some nights I need 14 hours of sleep. Like, oh man. I would totally... Totally take that in a heartbeat, but I would not be very happy with 14 hours of sleep every night. Werner, talk to me, baby! <laughs> I know this is kind of sudden, but be brutally honest. What do you think of my catchphrase? Yeah, we gotta get you we gotta get you taken care of here. Capital? Nah. Too bad we can't do wait, can we? Yowza. Ah, uh, Yowza Shanauza doesn't work. That's too bad. Okay, well, we'll just have you do. Yeah. 
That's it. You're one of us now. <laughs> all right, there we go. There we go, taken care of. See, it's important that all of our villagers know the language. Because otherwise, there would be confusion in the streets. Goldie, you're hiding behind this tree. We're not even playing hide and seek. Uh, you've been getting bored with your routine for slicing veggies. I got a few things. Uh, like what? I turn on I love you and I slice my veggies to the beat. What? Whoa, okay, that escalated quickly. Uh, I think it's improving my sense of rhythm, too. Did she just confess her feelings to me and she was making a veggie analogy? <laughs> oh, Goldie. Alright, let's see. We gotta get that darn scorpion. And before a third tarantula. I cry. Every time. <laughs> it's kind of boring, like, walking around town. I bet you everyone must be wondering, like, what are you doing, Porter? Like, why are you... Just walking back and forth through town. Isn't that a little weird? You're the mayor. Shouldn't you be doing important things? And the answer is yes, this is important. I'm trying to track a dangerous critter. Ooh. Random 18 say, now imagine spending months that doesn't sound very good. See, I think that's why I want to get this out of the way now. Rather than months. Every time I hear footsteps, or anything moving... Oh, is this new? I think this one's new. Sweet! We got a third one. Right? Because I think... There's another over by the cliffs by my house. I know that there's one down by the beach. But I think there's another over here. Unless I relocated it. Oh, yeah, it's right there. Sweet. We got three perfect. Well, not perfect roses. Um, Kind of a thing that only grows when you have a perfect town. I thought that waterfall, or water fountain was something moving around. Uh huh. What? What? Here, I found something that's so perfect for you, Water. It's some checkered tile. Oh, why, thank you. Nice of you. Not your style. Well, the garbage can is right over there. If you want to be polite, just wait until I leave. Well, at least she says it like it is. I like checkered tile, though. It looks nice. I just think I already have it. All right. Yeah, um, I already have one of the Jacob's Ladders down by the Blue Roses random. So it shouldn't be necessary to put any more down there. I mean, I could, but... I never really had success with it. The only time I've gotten blue roses was when I wasn't using fertilizer or Jacob's ladders. Like, I almost kind of find that comical. Because I tried for months before. Thank you. Okay, where is... Where's that present? Here, oh, I see it's shadow. I'm a shadow, the true self. Uh, all right, we're gonna have to do it like this. Mm 
Gotten a few of these tonight. Gotta make sure I actually have room for that thing, too. A kitty stereo. Oh, hey. Did I ever give mine away? I'm gonna get this thing refurbished. It looks pretty cool refurbished, actually. But there's another design. It looks good with it, too. Let me just scour really fast for scorpions. Yeah, I don't see any. We're good. Everything's fine. Oh, man. All right. Let's customize. Yeah, I got a project for you. Um, wow, I got a few projects. Patchwork table. Ooh. That could look nice. I want to do this kitty stereo. I think it'd look really cool. Alright, let's... Change this to... I have, like, fruit punch or something. Let's do pastel. Because I did fruit last time. And it looked nice. Very colorful, but I remember the pastel looked really nice, too. This will also make a good gift for someone in town. Like, Goldie? I don't even think she has a music player. Or maybe she does. And I just don't remember. I would have had to have given it to her. I don't think she... Oh, sorry, Soleil, I didn't even see you there! Which is kind of an awkward thing to say if I was pushing you out of the way, but... <laughs> Why was she hiding behind that tree? Oh, that was really funny. Uh, hi, Sylvia. Bones guarding the bridge. Okay, keep an eye on that bridge, buddy. Make sure no scorpions cross that thing. Alright, are we still... Yeah, we're still good. Will I find that scorpion tonight? Otherwise, the next night I'm going to have to check is Tuesday. So do they make a sound when they're nearby? I know tarantulas, you can kind of hear them shuffling around. But again, it's been a while. And the last one I saw, I don't think I was close enough to really hear much. Oh, yes, scorpions are louder, says Random? Dang. Okay, well, I'm not quite so concerned about missing it, then. Especially if it won't even attack me. Scattering leaves, I'm hearing Orpheolus say. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. Hunt! For scorpions. Where are you going, Bones? You wanna have like a race or something? Hmm. Well, at least I got some tarantulas. I guess in the end that's fine. I should put a tarantula away. You know what? Let me do that really fast to kind of. Reload everything. But I can put that on the stand thing. That I got refurbished. Let's see, if we set that right here, have that thing kind of looking at us. <laughs> oh, it'll look wild. Alright, let's put that there. And display this little thing. Look at that beast! What a jerk! Alright, let's put these fossils away, because I don't really need them right now. Um, I have more somewhere. We'll just put them here. I got, like, a few fossils I have to take away. Okay! Oh, darn it, it's 9.30. Well, let's give it, like, five more minutes, all right? I think that'll be good 
cut-off point for this. All right. Gotta find a scorpion. Also a lot easier with headphones. Like, I can really hear where everything is. I remember in my Benchton series, I didn't wear headphones. So it was, like, really tough to hear what was going on, because I had to have the volume low, so it didn't feed back into the microphone. Can I get rid of this thing? I guess I'll just catch it. I don't really know if that counts as being a bug. So we'll just do that. Wait, what happens? Can I release it? No, I can toss it. Wait, does that just... Cool. <laughs> That's amazing. Alright, let's see if I can find... Another one? Are you serious? These things are annoying. Because, like, I have to catch them in order to get rid of them. Alright, I'm gonna toss it in the fountain. Don't tell anyone. Oh, I can't even throw it. I lack the skills for that. Okay, I need a scorpion. You are not a scorpion. A survey. It's on light levels while sleeping. How bright do you like it at bedtime? Um, I literally don't care. I, I literally don't. I guess it's probably around there. I like a little bit of light. But... I can sleep if it's completely light. Unless someone were shining a light directly in my eyes. And even then I might be able to sleep. Like, I would believe it. But if it's too dark, it just makes it a pain. Like, if I need to get up or something, or when I'm going to bed. Like, that's the worst. You turn off the lights and then you have to, like, wander over to your bed. And it's like, you don't want to hit anything on the way there. Like, you have to have that path mapped out. Okay. Will we find that scorpion? The answer will shock you. It will shock you, I tell you. Two tarantulas so far. Night. Zero scorpions. But I will not yield. At least not for another minute. <laughs> or two, I don't know, we'll see. It's addictive, kind of looking for them. It's thrilling. on fire saying, I'm sorry, Marilyn, but I just caught a scorpion right now in my town. Well, congrats. You don't have to feel sorry about that. It's an accomplishment. Like, I'll get one. Hey, it's still better than the char, right? Like, honestly, I'd rather do this than try to find that stupid char ever again. That was the worst! Oh, man. That was just so not fun. <laughs> Try to, like, find that thing. Uh, yeah, I would definitely rather do this. find that char. 
I had the worst luck with that. And I have at least seen one scorpion. And even if- Oh, Celine's sitting on the bench! Hey, can I sit next to ya? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> that's adorable. I haven't actually had anyone sitting on the bench. This is where I come at the end of the week to unwind. It's so peaceful staring up to the sky. Aww. Soleil, you're adorable. Alright, let's see. If she's still there, I should probably... Gosh, there it is. Uh, why didn't it work? No! Gosh darn it! So, it went to my watering can instead of my net! Ah! <laughs> Gosh darn it! That didn't work! No! Oh, what? I shouldn't have ever put my thing away. Oh, if only I didn't talk to Soleil on the bench! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, that's just so sad! Because I put the thing away. I didn't want to be holding a shovel on the, the bench. It's not good etiquette. And then it, like, look, watering can. What? How am I supposed to catch a scorpion with a watering can? Ah! Okay, there we go. Oh, man. I have to find that thing again. Ah! <laughs> oh, that is pretty funny. Oh, no, is it? Which which way is it going? I think I'm gonna miss it. Yeah, it's, it's long gone. Yep, rip. See ya. Uh, that messed me up. If only I didn't take that time with Soleil. I mean, I really shouldn't blame Soleil. It was worth it. I'd rather have that than not, but... Oh, that really messed with me. Dang it. Now I gotta find it again. <laughs> it's like I had the perfect opportunity. The perfect opportunity. Like, I was ready for that thing. I saw it. I'm like, okay, let me get my net. This is not my net. Where is my net? And it's like, I didn't want to lose track of the thing. Oh, well, it happens. Uh, let's see. Just have to find another one. Okay, I gotta give it ten more minutes. Like, we came that close. We've at least proven that they're around. Ugh. I should really just put away all my other tools. You know, I really should. Why am I not doing that? <laughs> Here we go. There. Problem solved. I like my shovel, okay? Don't judge me. But now I don't have to worry about that happening again. Oh, man. What a jerk! What? Your personality has gone soft and flabby on you. A new greeting? Okay. Yeah! Yowza schnauza, schnauza works. Perfect. Yowza schnauza! Perfect. That is right. Yeah! Yowza schnauza! Okay, so it's worth it. It's worth it. See, if we didn't have... Or if we never caught... Or let me rephrase that. If we did catch the scorpion, we never would have had that catchphrase. Or that greeting. But now we've brought it to life. It has been immortalized. It was all meant to happen. We are not meant to catch the scorpion tonight. It will be another day. 
I feel like I should have put it in all caps, though. I think that would have been even better. Well, if ever he gets bored with it, we'll change to all caps. I mean, he did say capital. So clearly he wanted all caps. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe. <laughs> like, where's my nut? <laughs> Where is that thing? Bones? I've been kind of obsessed with getting a patchwork table lately. Oh, his entire life savings. All right, well, here you go. That's really weird. I just had a villager ping me. I thought you had to wait like five minutes. Bones just really wanted that table. Either that or really wanted to be financially irresponsible. Okay, I gotta talk to you now. <laughs> I gotta see it. Oh, you didn't say the, the greeting. Okay. Man that loves your festivals. Wonderful. But do you love scorpions? See, I feel like this is the closest thing to a sword I have. And that may be the only way I can fend off a scorpion if it wants to attack. Hmm. <laughs> well, at least I caught two tarantulas. All is not lost. Like, it wasn't a total waste. We got that. We got Rory a really good line. We got to sit on a bench with Soleil. Like, these are good things. This is fine. I can't wait to give that tarantula to someone. And they have to put it in their house. Like, they have to. I just want to go over to their house and see it. Oh, she's still on the bench. Goldie, why don't you ever sit on the bench? Or you, Bones. Yeah, I guess I'm not mad with Bones anymore. We had a little bit of a, a disagreement, let's say. But I think we got it all patched up. <laughs> Alright, let's get... Er, let's get this thing. Come on, drop it into water. Drop it into water. Alright, here we go. Yeah, it just evaporated. Okay. Final attempt. To get that scorpion. Where is this darn thing? It'd be great if we could actually catch one. Not have any technical issues. This time it's probably going to kill me, though. I bet you that's what's going to happen. I'm going to find it, and then it's going to win. And it'll be like, no, how could you do this? I won't say that's my greatest fear, but it is pretty, pretty great. Yeah, I'm sorry, Beautiful Days 4. We're almost done with the stream. I've been streaming for about an hour 45 this time, on top of two hours earlier. And I... am running out of juice trying to find this darn scorpion. Found one. Missed it. Due to some, uh, some technical difficulties. <laughs> to say the least. And found two tarantulas at least, so... It wasn't all that bad of a night. 
and got the police station and got the uh what else did we get the moon did I actually get the moon hello uh can you take my rally tea off my hands sure And she's giving me, like, two things today. Kind of suspicious, if you ask me. All right. Go away, bug. Just give me a scorpion. It's the only bug I need. Well, okay, I mean, right now. I need some other bugs, but that's the only one I need right this very moment. Yeah, I think we're just gonna have to call it. Get you next time, Gadget. Oh, gosh darn it. Okay. This is gonna mess me up, isn't it? Actually, let's just go ahead and equip this. No! No! No, 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 not like this. Okay, there we go. <laughs> oh, I could have sworn there'd be bees there. All that for a balloon lamp. Okay, shovel. Put these things away. And grab this money. Alright. Crisis averted. Actually, I should test. Yeah, we good. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. All right, Scorpion, one more try. Last chance. Yeah, we got, we got no scorpions. Oh well, it's fine. Third time is a charm, right? And that will be our third time when we catch it. We'll shoot for that Tuesday night then. I think that'll be a good, good night for it. I just don't want to quit. Darn it. I will get you. We'll get this thing. Okay, I'm going to walk back to my house. Except I want to go this way. Oh, no, I didn't want to go back to my house. I wanted to sit next to Soleil. Okay, well, I'll make one more lap. I'll go to my house, and then I will, um, I'll sit next to Soleil. That's it. Then I'm done. We don't find that thing by then. It's over! What's up? I smell some checkered tile. It's yours, isn't it? How'd you know? Uh, I don't really want to trade it, but sure. Sure, why not? Okay. How does it look, though? Kind of curious. Uh, blue tartan tea. Yeah, 
could be interesting. Actually, hold up. I'd have a better chance of seeing it. If I walk upwards. And... Oh, no! What? What's your problem? <laughs> what happened? Hey, even I can be mad sometimes, you know? <laughs> what? What? Oh no, looks like they got into a fight. Dude, I'm like way sad right now. Oh, and I missed it. I hate missing the drama. All right, well, you know what? Let's not miss any drama. And we're just gonna sit right next to Soleil. Aw. All right, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you on the next episode of Maryland's Animal Crossing New Leaf Adventures in... Chaville. See you next time, everyone. Woo!